In this video, we'll be looking at how we can navigate between the screens and how we can maintain the navigation history. So if you have multiple screens and if you use if user is navigating from multiple screens, he should be able to navigate back in a same sequence. So you can do that. You can maintain the navigation history as well. So let's first see what is the what are the functions available to navigate across the screens. So I've added some sample screens here. You can see welcome yellow white and success screen so on the welcome screen i've added two buttons let's navigate so what you need to do is go to the on select property and look for navigate function um, you there are two parameters which you need to pass first is the screen name where you want to navigate so i want to navigate to white screen and then your transition mode is the second parameter so there are some transition options We'll try it out. Well, let's first select cover, which is this one. I'll just copy this code and go to yellow screen, same property on select and paste it here. Instead of white screen, I'll make it yellow screen. And the transition mode, I'll change it. We'll just see the effect of it. What is the difference between cover and cover right? And let's just run it. Okay, so click. I'll click on white screen you can see the effect now let's just try it again now here I've added a back icon now if you want to navigate back to the previous screen from where you navigated so there is a separate function for it which will that is what we use to maintain the navigation history function called back so you don't need to use navigate function because if you use navigate function you have to specify the screen name for the back you don't need to specify the screen name it will take you back to the previous screen now here we'll try uncover option so uncover and uncover right options usually you when you navigate back to the previous screen so let me just click back you can see white back white back now let's just try this Okay, just see okay I haven't added a function here I'll add a back function here as well let's just see the effect of cover and cover right so this is cover and this is cover right so you can see the screen is coming from this side to this one to the right so and this one is coming from left and cover right it is coming from the left to right that that's what that's how the transition will happen between the screen now we have seen you can how you can navigate and how you can navigate back now let's just go ahead and move to the other screens navigation so I've added here you can this is success screen okay I'll just change the text here move to the end screen and on Y screen as well move to the end screen same and on the success screen I have added another navigation which will take you back to the welcome screen now if you see this white screen move to the end screen we are here and you are back on the welcome screen so that's the, the those are the two functions which you need to use so if you look at the format of the navigate function navigate screen name and the transition options you can use cover or cover right fade is also there uh, or you can just keep it none and while navigating back you can use uncover and uncover right and back function this is to back move back to the previous screen so it's pretty simple you can use uh, both of these functions for the navigation between the screen I hope this will help you guys. Thank you so much for watching.